the last 24 hours, they got five inches, which I was like, come on, that's it? But we looked at the week-long total, as you suggested, Kelly, and it's 92 inches yeah. of snow <laughs> this it's, week at Wolf Creek. It's been busy up yeah. there. And yes, you will pick up more snow around Wolf Creek uh, today. In fact, a lot of it coming later today and through the overnight hours. We're going to see areas of rain and snow increase across New Mexico as we get you into the afternoon and evening. Winds are going to pick up. Winds are going to be even stronger tomorrow. So yes, we're talking about Saturday morning snow for Albuquerque. Our snow window probably not going to last very long, but then the winds kick in and it's going to be very blustery and cold cold through the afternoon. Sunday morning, meanwhile, coldest air of the season. As we take a look at this afternoon, we're going to see those showers increase to the west. And yes, we start dumping that mountain snow to the north. You see a lot of rain down to the south with snow only in the higher elevations and temperatures in most locations outside of the mountains warm enough for rain or at least a rain snow mix. But overnight, here comes that cold air. So this will be snow. And yes, there will definitely be areas of blowing snow causing visibility issues overnight into tomorrow morning. As we get into the afternoon, the moisture pulls to the east, but the winds pick up. So you see temperatures topping out in the 20s and 30s north, still some 40s and 50s to the south, but those strong winds are going to be very unpleasant. And yes, they'll be blowing some snow around uh, that has piled up on the ground in some locations. Sunday morning, clear and cold below zero for Grants, for Gallup, for Durango, for Taos, for Raton, and some of us above zero are expected to have wind chills below zero early Sunday morning. So yeah, it is definitely going to be unpleasant to say the least. As we take a look at the forecast for Albuquerque, 60% mixed late. Uh, we're talking rain this evening, turning to snow overnight into tomorrow morning, and then very windy in the afternoon. That high of 38 is going to feel like it's in the 20s, and Sunday morning we start at 11, but those temperatures do rebound next week.